Hey everybody, Ray here. Welcome to It's All About the Cocktail. So I made some coconut cream and I want to make some drinks with it. So today we're going to make a pina colada. But we're not going to make any old pina colada. I've seen a lot of stuff out there. You know, food people, everybody making pina coladas. So I'm not uh, the guy from the love boat or on a cruise ship or anything like that. But you're in luck because you're going to get a pina colada from an Irishman. And we like them a little bit on the boozier side, okay? So the whole idea here is simple cocktails. And a pina colada is not a lot of things. It's coconut cream, pineapple juice, and rum, okay? Some people like a little lime juice. I don't think it's necessary, okay? So let's begin. Get to it, Ray. Okay. So take your shaker tin. Now you can use, I'm going to use a little bit of, of dark rum. And a little bit of white rum. If you want to just use your gold rum, you can do that too. Okay, I'm going to use two parts of our white rum. In this case, I'm going to use Bacardi. It's a drink of Puerto Rico, so I'm going to use a Puerto Rican rum in this case. Okay, so I'm going to use two parts of our Bacardi Superior White. Now, I could go fancy with you. I got some some fancy rums but you know what I want to keep this simple the whole idea here is simple cocktails at home I don't whip out these weird weird fashioned ingredients you're like where do I get that from so I'm gonna keep it simple put some Bacardi in there okay and then one part of our dark okay and then we're simply gonna use Pour that in our shaker. And then we're simply going to use two parts of our coconut cream, which I made up. Now, a lot of the coconut creams I don't like because it's got too much additives and too much sugar in there. I made a batch up using less sugar than it called for, but that's it works just it's fine, just fine. Now I'm going to put two parts of this in there. I'm running out there, but that's okay. I got a lot more here. Okay. Pour that in our shaker. I'm just going to kind of pour it back and forth, back and forth, so I can make sure I can get all that cream out of there. Then we're simply going to put two and a half to three parts of pineapple juice in there. I'm going to use two and a half parts. I mean, some I've seen some people. I've seen some people that ask for like three parts of of coconut cream and three parts of pineapple juice, and that's way too sweet for me. So we're just going to use two and a half parts of our pineapple juice in there. I like these little cans. Because although they are sweetened, they are convenient. They're very convenient. If you want to get on sweetened pineapple juice, that's all the better. But I found these little cans were good because you can shake them up, get them nice and foamy, and throw them in your fridge, and they keep real nice. Okay, now what I'm going to do is I'm I'm just going to throw I'm going to throw this into our into our Neutral bullet. I'm gonna throw a couple more, a couple more pieces of pineapple in there, and then I'm gonna throw the rest of my shaker tin full of ice from my whiz bang ice maker. Throw that in our shaker. A screw on the top. Make sure it's nice and tight so nothing comes flying out. Put that in our Neutral boy. 
Yeah, baby. Okay, now that we're done there, take it out of our our Nutribullet. You now, now you can pour this in a your tiki mug. It's actually got from Jamaica or something like that. You can throw on your one of your tiki mugs. You can throw on one of your little tiki mugs. Yeah, woo, your little dresser, your little your little bombs look like they're falling off there. Anyways, but you know what? I'm gonna throw it in a hurricane glass. I got out of my spare, my spare fridge. You know, if you don't got a spare fridge or a chiller or anything, take your glass, throw ice in there, and let it get nice and cold. Easy enough. But I got a one. So let's use it. Okay. Now you don't have to have you don't have to have a a Nutribullet or a blender even. If you want to, you can shake this. I've I've done that. You can shake it. It works. Comes out just fine. Now, like I said, I made some coconut cream using coconut flakes. Okay. Then what you want to do is you want to get yourself a nice garnish. Okay. Now I happen to have, I had a pineapple, which I cut in little chunks. So I'm gonna take one of these. I'm gonna put a spear through it. Now you can you can use your maraschino cherries. A lot of the recipes call for a maraschino cherry, but I want to be a little bit different. And I happen to found Rainier cherries in the fridge. These things are great. So I'm gonna use a Rainier cherry. I think it'll swallow that pit. And then put just a little a little umbrella on there. The Ray, really, I don't have umbrellas. Man, these things are it's like your tiki stores online. It's like cheap. I want to say roughly under ten bucks or something. But get, get yourself a little umbrella. And I got blue so much my little blue flowers in there. Isn't that pretty? Like so, just like an umbrella. And you open it up. There you go, Ray. Poke that in your. Poke that in your. We're definitely gonna have straw there, Ray. If you wanted to, you could even give them a coconut little thing so they can mix it up when it gets lower, a little bit lower. But that's your pina colada done by an Irishman. Hope you like it. Let's check that out. Let's give it a whirl. Wow, that's good without being overly sweet. Some of those coconut creams uh, seem like really, really sweet to me. That's why I made my own with a little bit less sugar. I mean, when you get older, you don't like all that sugar. So, I'd like you to subscribe. I mean, of course, I'd like you to like this, share with somebody, and subscribe. But definitely send me a comment and let me know. Do you like pina coladas? Do you like lots of rum in your pina coladas? Have you been on vacation and had a pina colada? Send me back a comment and let me know what's going on with you, okay? But I want you to remember, my friends, at the end of the day, it's all about the cocktail. Yeah, baby. I'll be seeing you just in time for the next round. See you later. I swear it keeps fighting me. I don't want to go in, Roy. I really don't want to go in, man. I like it out of here, Roy. Come on, five more minutes, man. Come on.